so good evening everyone so we are back to our youtube channel we have sergio's math class so at this point of time so let's proceed to the topic also all about grouping symbols i hope everyone you all enjoy this moment and have fun uh, together with me discussing this one this grouping symbols so this time we will encounter uh different symbols the first one is this is parenthesis and this is bracket and this is braces and this is the vinculum so these are the symbols that we are going to encounter this day so i have here the problem so we have two and so on so we're going to look at here how we're going to remove the symbols of grouping and we're going to combine like terms the best thing that we're going to do is we are going to uh, remove first the grouping symbols in the inner portion like this so inner portion of these terms okay so we need to uh, group first or we need to simplify first the inner terms of the groupings of the symbols okay so let's proceed with number one okay so we are now in number one so the first thing that we're going to do when you encounter this kind of problem is that we have to solve first at the inner portion so we need to remove first the inner portion so this time the inner portion is this so we have to simplify first we have a step-by-step -step solution in order for us to come up a good and a correct answer and very refined answer as well so 2a minus b so step by step po tayo, minus this is 2ac minus c plus 2ac then minus c okay so if we're going to look at here we have we can cancel this part so 2 2a minus b that is 2a minus c minus c okay 2 so 2a minus 2ab my plus bc okay, distributive property okay so by the way this is plus by the way so this is plus and plus so therefore this is minus bc minus c okay so 2 2a minus 2ab will write first so minus c so in this case distribute individually okay so 4a minus 4ab minus 2bc minus 2c so this is the result when you remove the grouping symbol so we have now the simplified answer okay so we're back here number two so in this case we have here the inner portion and the inner portion of our problem so copy first okay we have to simplify first so this is 2a so distribute minus 4b okay so minus 3 a squared minus we have to first simplify the inner term but i need po tayo maguguluan dito so a squared minus a b okay so next we have distribute okay we can now distribute uh, but we have to simplify first for simplifying so this is a minus 4b minus so we could simplify first 
So, a squared. At this time, we can now distribute because wala po tayong makukombine. So, distribute. Alright. So, negative 3b. Next is negative a squared. Why negative? Because preceded siya. So, plus ab po. Okay. Okay. So, next, we have to simplify. So, 4a minus 16b minus distribute po 3a squared and plus 9b distribute naman plus 3a squared and distribute minus 3ab okay so we need to cancel okay this part so, meron pa ba? Okay, meron pa. So, 4A. So, you're going to add this part. It's negative 7B. And minus 3AB. So, ito po ang kasagutan natin. This is the answer. 4A minus 7B minus 3AB. Okay, so we are back and we are in number 3. So, 2x plus this part in the quantity of y, quantity 4x minus, quantity of z plus 2y, quantity plus z, quantity minus 2y. So, we have going to simplify first the inner portion here. So, 2x plus 2, so y minus 4x distribute minus z distribute minus 2y okay plus z minus 2y so 2x plus 2 so y so distribute the sign 4x plus z plus 2y then you're going to add here plus z minus 2y. So we could now, okay, so we have to combine first to so 2x plus 2y. Okay, this is 3y. When you add 2y and this is 3y minus 4x, okay, plus 2z minus to y so 2x plus distribute okay distribute na naman 6y minus 8x plus 4z minus 2y so we are going to simplify so this is 2x and negative 8x that is negative 6x and y and y we have plus 4y and plus 4z. So this is the result. Alright, so we are now in number 4. So in this case, we have to simplify first this part. Okay. So copy 6t minus 4e minus the quantity of 2f plus 2 minus d plus e minus 2d plus 2f. You have to distribute the sign. Do not forget e plus e. Okay. So next, what we're going to have, okay, nawala na po ito. Ah, hindi pa, hindi pa. Okay. Close parenthesis bracket. So therefore, this is here. Okay. So, because we are going to distribute first the 2. So, we have 6D minus 4E minus 2F plus, ah, okay. So, we have to distribute the sign. So, therefore, this will become negative 2D plus 2E minus 4D. And 
plus 4f plus a okay plus a so first we have to simplify so we have 2f 4d so you're going to add 4f and 2f and 4f so copy first okay so this is 6f and we have d here so minus 6d and the e is plus 3e then plus e so you're going to combine all like terms here so 6d minus 4e we have to going to distribute again the sign here so 6f plus 6d minus 3e plus e at this time you're going to add all e so first d plus d we have 12 d next we have e negative 4 negative 3 and ne e plus e is negative 6 e next we have minus 6 f so this is the result so we are now in the last number which is number 5 so if we're going to look at we have here the process of vinculum so vinculum the same way that is the same uh, rule in parentheses bracket and braces so we have to distribute the sign so first we have here x times x that is x squared minus 4x plus 8 so 3x minus 2x then x plus 5y minus 3x distribute this one the sign here we could still distribute minus x then plus 2 okay so the sign is being distributed here so x squared minus 4x plus 8 okay so 3x minus 2x so 3x minus 2x quantity x 5y distribute here the sign so minus 3x plus x minus 2 okay so x squared minus 4x plus 8 so 3x we have to combine first before we have to distribute so x plus 5y okay x plus 5y so we have here negative 2x so x x plus x so the remaining here is negative x so x plus x that is 2 minus 3x that is negative x that is plus 5y minus 2 okay copy so this is x squared minus 4x plus 8 so we have here 3x and we have to distribute so plus 2x squared then minus 10xy then ma plus 4x okay so x squared minus 4x and we have to distribute back here but before that we have to simplify so 8 so this is 7x plus 2x squared minus 10xy so next we have to distribute so x squared minus 4x plus 8 times 7 okay 56x distribute plus 16x squared and distribute minus 
80xy. So we have to simplify combine x squared. So we have 17x squared. Next is we have plus 52x because 56 minus 4 minus 80xy. So this is the result. So this time, we are going to try this one at home once again. So remove the grouping symbols and combine like terms. So right, so we have here 3, 3 times the quantity of A minus 5B minus the quantity of 7A minus the quantity of 3 times the quantity of A minus the vinculum of B minus 2, quantity plus 4, quantity and quantity. So therefore, we have to simplify that one and please have your answer on the chat box. Thank you once again. Maayong adlaw.